What? <laughs> what did you do? Gentlemen, welcome back to Patron Cast Plays Mortal Kombat X. Is that how we're opening? Yeah. Please tell yeah. Me how we're opening. <laughs> Why not? Awesome. So I'm Razor. Uh, Shad and Smoke Matter here. Uh, and we're, I'm uh, This is Hello. part three of our story mode run through. Uh, I believe we left off with Takeda? Started Takeda? Yeah, that's, I, f yes. I forget. Yes, it was Takeda. He was whining about something. All right, yeah, we got I don't want to watch Melina die again. This is filler. This is all filler. I've seen it. People, seen people it. love watching Melina die. Seen about? it. <laughs> okay. What are uh, what are my moves here? We've got what is tornado strike? It's That's just the... a kick? No, it's not. No, it's not. Oh, uh, there it's it is. Thing. There it is. Okay, it just wasn't popping before. I was <laughs> doing. Okay, this has a very like sensitive range. If he's up in my face, rushing me down like he's doing, it's not gonna you hit. Can, you, you can hold a uh, fucking situation. Okay, yeah, yeah. If hold, I hold, yeah. if I hold back, it'll do it close range. There we go. Oh, man, I sure I'm glad you remember how to play this game. Yeah, right? The, op the opposite also. Uh, Dude, I do not play fucking harder. Takeda. <laughs> I've never even liked that move. I think that's his worst special move. Okay, and then we've got... This is this is basically a Taven move. This has come back. In Pog form. <laughs> 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 okay, let's see what the variation gives us. We've got Blade oh, Drop. You, you got the oh, lightsaber. Oh, no, the lightsaber variation. Yeah. Hey. You gotta be fucking kidding me with this. Look, they, is that telekinesis? The power he yeah. does not have in story mode? He only has telepathy? <laughs> yeah. You, you you inherit it from your parents, you say. Yeah, I thought Kenshi didn't have powers until he got Sento. Why does Takeda have powers? <laughs> it's in the blood. No, but yeah, using I, I, I Sento is in the blood. <laughs> How does that work? How the it's, fuck does that special move work? So he crosses them in an X and it shoots a fireball. That's... Fucking magnets. <laughs> Why don't people do that more in Star Wars? Yeah, right? Fights to be so much more interesting that way. Anakin used two lightsabers a couple of times. He never shot a fireball with them. <laughs> okay, so I believe this uh, reflects projectiles. It doesn't look all that great. Which uh, Kenshi doesn't really have in this variation? Nope. And then Shirai Ryukin. What? Shirai Ryukin. Well, if he'd stop attacking me so I can see my move. There we go. It would unwake yeah, up. Yeah, what a surprise. You see, it's a reference. Shirai Ryukin! I see what I, they did there. I get it. <laughs> nah. Nah. Now get up. I want to knock you down again. Ow, the edge! Takeda, cease! So... Kenshi did not abandon you. He <sighs> brought you here for your protection. Protection from what? From those who murdered your mother. He didn't know this when he joined the clan. We saw how he joined the clan in MKX comic book, and he that should know that story I asked Master Hisashi to tell you. there were assassins after his mom in that. But in truth, your mother was killed by Red Dragon assassins. I was the target. He was 13. His memories of this should not be gone. <laughs> I couldn't tell you myself because I'm a terrible father. your fault. <laughs> Your father has devoted his life to fighting animals like the Red Dragon. And he not raising you. Who are oh, you. I remember now. They said some stuff about how uh, Kenshi wanted Scorpion to keep all the Red Dragon stuff from Takeda until he was old enough. Because he didn't want him to run off looking for revenge as a teenager and get himself killed because he was too young. That's right. I would like you to keep all this red dragon stuff to yourself. <laughs> also, I would like you to keep Takeda to yourself. <laughs> I have to go now. How, how did you do that? We are telepaths. A family gift. No, the sword See? is the gift! This doesn't make sense! <laughs> Kenshi only has powers because he has the sword! <laughs> Remember when Sindel used fans, and that's why Katana uses fans? <laughs> this is work. That's how these things work, yeah? I remember in MK9 when they tried to give Katana the, the family hairstyle. Question is, is she working with Do you think, like, generations of Cyrax's have used nets and bombs? I hope not. Damn. 
He's made us. Okay, guys. Yeah, yeah. Cyrax's ancestors had access to laser nets. <laughs> Fucking. 1800s Africa, that stuff was all over the place. <laughs> okay, now here comes a quick time event. And I'm gonna let Reptile get a few shots in, because Reptile has earned it. <laughs> yeah, he has. Also, fuck Takeda. A little bit. Yeah! I mean, he's using the invisibility. Why wouldn't he get a few shots in? If you, if you know you what, just percent the sequence, you're an asshole. <laughs> just, just let it all happen. Every bit of it. Well, see, now he starts using the telepathy. So now, ah, see, he got him in the eyes. He got him in the eyes, but he—it's not even a wound on his face. Now, ah, yeah, now he's blind, see, just like his dad. Everything does run in the family. See, if he's gonna use the telepathy, then I have to do the bit. Fair enough. I'm sorry, Reptile, buddy. I rooted for you. Reptile got every shot in but two. That's pretty good. Okay, okay now you got I the have, good variation. Yeah, I have a different variation, because we're the, the past and the future are two different movesets. Okay, so... <laughs> now Reptile's got the juice! Yeah, yeah, he's kicking my ass. <laughs> so I throw a kunai at the ground. I got that. Um, I still have this- this stupid fucking tornado strike. Oh, he just dodged with it. Look at that. Look at all that skillful, artful <laughs> dodging. Okay. Now we actually get to use the whips. Oh, Christ. Oh, I forgot about that overhead one. That, that one looks bad. Okay, buddy. I can't x-ray while he's in nimble mode? No, it's it's, Isn't it's it aerial. It's from the air. Oh, you fuck! I hate aerial X-rays so fucking much. <laughs> Using them or receiving them? Using them. It's so counterintuitive because there's only ever one guy on the roster at a time who has one. <laughs> well, now there's two. I like his X-ray. Yeah, it's all it's right. It's pretty good. Okay, I don't like salt. his throw. His throw is bland. Yeah, he just kind of breaks her arm. There we go, that's the shit. That's my favorite fucking move of his. Yeah, see, this is this is how you should be using him. I'm just shocked it didn't come back in 12. And I think this command would have been the Taven punches in the other variation? Yeah, like back yeah, forward yeah. Y? Yep, yep, yep. Omega Destroyer! And then whip trip. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Denied. Nice try, buddy. Bitch. One down, two to go. <laughs> so there was a, they put an effect in there where Jin dropped his bow and the bow teleported out of the scene. Where does it go when it does that? Deal. Go help with Armor space. Got this. <laughs> Same place. I don't know. Why tons of fans you go. Shoot your guns? You yeah. Alone? Yeah. Why didn't he? He just ran at him while holding two pistols instead of pulling the trigger. <laughs> Thought out guns work, Aaron. Oh, you the hats off. Yeah. Yeah. I hate the variation where the hats off just for the aesthetics. What is the point of playing Aaron Black if think... you don't have a hat? Oh God. I think he... I, I do love hat? that move. Yeah, see, that's that's where he actually pulls the trigger. Now it looks. The hat I think is only in one. Yeah, yeah. The two out of three variations, he's not wearing the hat. It's. So Why would you be bad. a cowboy and not? I I don't see. I missed the X-ray because it's a fucking aerial arc. Could, could you imagine if if like Jason only had the hockey mask on for one <laughs> variation? <laughs> What is Takeda's uh, third? I don't even remember. Uh, it's the one where he wears the... It's the Ryu stuff. Yeah. But what does it's that where... actually give him moveset-wise? Uh, Scorpion I should stuff. be dead. He just yeah, shot me sure. five times in the head with a gun. <laughs> I mean, if you want to play the I should be dead game, should be very dead. More dead. 
dead. But no, uh, Takeda gets like a bunch of like, I like not scorpion kick. spear moves in the the other one. All uh, right, but he uses the whips. He like uses the. Like, he uses the whips to, to pull them in and shit, yes, yeah. Yes, yes, so he actually, like, has two movesets around the whips, and then the third one doesn't use the whips. When the That's whips correct. should really be his whole thing. Gonna be the weird odd man out. I've never liked the whips or the lightsabers. Oh, you're I weird. mean, just, you know, pick one weird. thing, you know? Well, yeah, I the mean, whips should be the, the one thing. The Would one you like thing. them better? Would you like them better if he if they were the one thing? I feel like I feel like I'd like him better if he was using two actual normal kunai. I've never been a fan of the whips. It's something about it. It's just his entire aesthetic. You know, he's always been my least favorite of all of all four combat kids. All so, so you he's want so to be more weird like to me because because he's my favorite know. combat kid. Yeah, he's my he's, favorite too. He's so Metal Gear. I've never really liked it. Well, that's the because Kenshi's very Metal Gear. <laughs> like I, I I don't know. Like he's already. Like Scorpion enough, just like if you're gonna the, the idea him two of like Scorpion spears, just like straight up, that that'd be oh, it'd be making a... well, it'd be use... like making Takeda another Jackie, you know? It's yeah, too yeah, similar. The, the whips is like taking the the Shirai Ryu thing of roped weapons and making it modern because he's the next generation. Like maybe it I could deal with makes the... a lot of sense. Maybe I could deal with the whips if they weren't so tech-based. I don't know. I, that's what I like about him, because... <sighs> because he's not just, like, the next Scorpion. He's also yeah, got ties to his dad, who works with the Special Forces. Like, they say uh, in his intros that the whips were invented by Jax. I'm more of a Kung Jin guy. Shoot me. I, Jin okay. would be fine without that primary costume, I guess. I don't know. I think I think there's more you could do than what they did with the bow and arrow gimmick. Like if he had some yeah. more trick arrows, like a green arrow kind of guy, where he was like shooting some kind of sticky stuff. Oh and yeah, bombs he's like, like, and like MK could use a proper archer, and it should yeah. be him. You whiffed the fuck out of that. Well done. No, it's a very <laughs> bad move. It's a very, very bad, yeah, like, kind of so, useless move. I, so much of the, his stuff has, like, a parabolic arc. I fucking hate... Just... Like, I, I just don't like how the hit comes at the end of the animation like that. Oh, like, I, I think I said it on the first episode. I think that move would have been better if, like, the blade whips were out as he's spinning. Yeah, that would be... the blade whips were, like, cutting them. Yeah, if there was a hitbox around the entire spin instead of it just being like a a fancy way to do a landing attack, that would be much better. Yeah. I think I've had enough of that wolf. You know, I hate to admit it, but playing him this kind of makes me wonder what his moves are like in twelve, because seeing Takeda in a game with no variations might be, you know. What he he's needs. got a Spider-Man kick, like a like a swing kick. Okay, that, that, web swing. I can, I can yeah. deal with that. Yeah, he's got a web swing. She stole the egg, um, then help them escape. He doesn't have the fucking auto combo move where he's just like moving the whip super fast around like that. That that does not come back in twelve for some reason. I'm sorry. What part of what just Something happened didn't makes come them... back in twelve? Wow. What? What part makes them assume that Devora was working together with the combat kids? They were not there at the same time. We're all in one piece. No one seems to be tailing us. Have you been able to determine where Devora was headed? We think she's headed for the Sea of Blood. Damn. Dad? She's coming here to Quan Chi. There's a secret portal near the Sea of Blood. Quan Chi had it built with so you notice that they're mentioning a sea of blood Great. in Outworld. Dad, what are you doing? Why are you in the nursery? Yeah, in Outworld, <laughs> where it was in Shaolin monks. Yeah, I'm doing this for Sonya. There can what? be multiple, multiple seas of blood. Just, just uh, saying. I just, one game later, where is the sea of blood? That's all I'm fucking it's, saying. It's, it's not the same sea. It's a different sea of blood. I. Okay, so if Outworld had a continent called Australia, would you find that weird? You know how weird? many places are named Memphis? They'll be fine. Most of the Memphises are named after one other Memph- like- <laughs> I'm just saying! I, 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 Name I, I, get I, around! I think like, it's very- and I think it's, it's, it's Mortal Kombat! 
there are going to be X's of blood everywhere. Seas, lakes, rivers, streams of piss, you name it. Shut up, Serena's it's on all screen. It's all man. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's very Please weird. Please keep it in your that... pants. I realize you I, I Nobody can see. I think it's very weird that you're drawing okay, the line oh, at reason... but you'll accept two seas of blood. There is a reason we don't I'm, use I'm face hovering, cam. <laughs> I'm hovering over the stop watching button. I'm afraid of what's going to come onto my screen. Eh, these horses are kind of neat. They're okay. I think, I think it's interesting. Like, like I'm inclined like to ask why don't they just teleport where they're going? But like the game hasn't really done a good job of covering the it. But it's we're supposed to figure out that Quan Chi is weaker when Shinnok is imprisoned than he would otherwise be. Like he doesn't have all of his magic. That's weird. Yeah. Which one of those horses is <laughs> Fucking Striker with the gun. He still has a normal gun. I turned this man elbows. into a zombie so that I could harness the power of a pistol. <laughs> Why is Cabal bothering to ride the horse? He yeah, is right? the horse. Cabal, I, didn't we point this out before? Cabal never uses super speed this entire story mode. So I wanna I wanna point out earlier in the Sonya chapter when they were attacking Quan Chi's study, Quan has a line where he says, I have no need of your soldiers, but I will uh, you know, take you as servants. You know, turn them into revenants. What is the difference between that and Stryker? Go back into hiding. Hiding. Stryker um, has heart. Does he? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes he does. Okay, we've got the Bionic Rush. Let's... Ground... Ground Pound, which, uh, I guess... <laughs> need to hold back to get close. You can't build Captain Planet without heart, you know? I swear to God, this game is on easy. Why don't they let me do stuff? <laughs> Skill issue? Fucking... <laughs> there we go. Okay. And even though I've got bionic arms, I get this instead of rockets. I'm never going to say no to the MK2 waves. Eh, I like the rockets better. It's an aesthetics thing. You can... If, if anything is an argument for variations, different projectiles. Yeah, right? Why not? But instead of the rockets, they gave him a, a machine gun. Doesn't he have the rockets in other variations? No, 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 no. You, you know, he you know has a... Is? He has a uh, like a rocket launcher, like it doesn't come out of his arm. Yeah, arms. one one of his variations, he has a rocket launcher strapped to his back. Oh, okay. So we're too good to fire missiles out of our fists now. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Doesn't matter. These fists are for punching. Like so, and so, and so. <laughs> you think you're bad? You ain't bad. <laughs> I like that line a lot. That's a quality Jack's line. Jax is, Jax is the undisputed champion of Mortal Kombat one-liners. He gets all the best ones. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna need you to stop. You know, this costume reminds me a lot of Annihilation, Jax. He does have a vest. Sleeveless vest over uh, shirtlessness. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, it looks good. Yeah. There was there was nothing no. wrong with his costume in Annihilation. No, no he looked great. Liberty notice was great. Notice the red and black fireballs Liu Kang is throwing. Yes. No. The ones he won't have in the next game. Hello, Miss. Not appearing as a selectable character in this game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Enraging thousands. Whatever, it's fun. I'm about to fight her. <laughs> Why would that hurt him? How are Those you are... feeling him? He Why doesn't do have feel hands that? in there. <laughs> Tactile input or something. There, there that looks no... really uncomfortable. That's yeah, yeah, that's not great. <laughs> that's like, that's hell on your back. Could you imagine if that like... Yeah, I don't even want to say that. How come... No. Uh... How come Sindel got all these fancy new sleeves to her outfit and none of the ever other Revenants got any new parts to their costumes? They really feel like they were, I don't know, 
the NPC 70 ones, I mean. 70% towards making her a playable, fully-fledged character. It's only, it's only a real explanation for this. Her and Rain, they were... They definitely had to have been considering it. Because, like, the difference, as you said, is just... It's insane. Yeah. She was gonna be part of the roster. I disagree. You hmm. would. If you, uh... If you hold that hammer blow, they pop up into the air. No better time for a gotcha. Well, I'm trying to do the backbreaker, because it's an air throw. Which means they have to be in the fucking air. <laughs> do a neutral jump punch. I, I can't do that shit, all right? I'm not that good. To, to press up? And then a button? You're too good to press up? Look, I get hit when I fucking jump because I'm not good at the game. <laughs> I mean, you get hit when you do all kinds of moves. Okay. Try new ones. Never know. Fucking power bomb. There we go. The things that are not good for your back or your ribs. All I want to do is wrestle, but there's not enough fucking wrestling. There was more wrestling in 9. There you go. <laughs> but it knocked her out, so I don't get to... There'll be more backs to break. Could you do it in, after a jump kick? That would I think depend you can. on the trajectory arc of them flying backwards from the kick. It depends on the game. It, it, Typically, it, it, you can it, do it. This, this dialogue. You, you can do it in ninety percent of them. This this shit about oh, uh, Bihan taught me emotion. When did that happen? I played mythologies. They talked for five seconds and then she died. That was what the beautiful music represented, Razor. Okay. <laughs> Call yourself a lore master. Oh, and this part. Okay. This game started with a sequence where Johnny is talking to Revenant Jax, and Revenant Jax is, you know, has villain dialogue and says that he, he enjoys being undead and that you will too when I kill you and whatnot. And then in this scene, Jax is like, Katana, why do you say those things? <laughs> yeah, like, he's the last person that should be making that assertion. You were there, dude. You know you had no control over yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't enjoy it yourself. Someone made you enjoy it. She's under it. mind control. <laughs> you know this. That's not what I'm talking about. <sighs> it's not what you should be talking about either. I just more power bombs. That's the solution to all of this. The story mode should just be all power bombs. Yes, I agree. <laughs> Damn straight. It won't let me jump like I'm fucking bolted to the ground after I do that move. Jump kick her and then just start Too mashing. Much... There, there it is. Go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, that was satisfying. <laughs> okay. Fucking. You suck! What did I say? How many times? <laughs> You're saying it like... <laughs> I don't agree with you! One day you'll get some. One day. You know, I just noticed the pocket with the cigars on it. That's nice. Yeah, that's been there the whole time. <laughs> I never noticed. I'm fine. wonder what he smoked while he was dead. Where are you going? Gonna bag me Ashes, that jar of black and hell. Human fingers. <laughs> yeah, I <laughs> like it. In your weakened state, is it possible for you to release Shinnok? Yeah, see, I this is. And Devora. His, his magic is. That's not a quad thrown. It's a chair. And I'll be waiting. It's the best they could do. Jackson Briggs. Why does the chair disappear? Uh, oh. Nothing pleasant. He's still sitting. It like it's like not there when so, uh, when it's from the uh, from behind. I'm going to let Lou hit all of these because I think it looks more badass to walk through them than to block them. Also, everything Ew, Liu Kang is saying in this scene is true. 
Like, like, Liu Kang is technically right. He's just... If he wasn't working for Quan and Shinnok, he would have the moral high ground in his personal feud against Raiden. <laughs> Elaborate, please. Uh, they never will. I guess being a disembodied head, that that's pretty much worse than death. That's true, and there was precedent for that in this very game. Yeah. Thank you for the reminder. I guess not being able to jump and do the backbreaker move yeah, is... it won't... God, I'm fucking tied to the... There's too much recovery. You know what you should do? Do a neutral jump punch. No, you should be like Striker Stop. and use more guns. <sighs> Striker knows what's going on. He killed even... dude. You saw it. Okay, let me... Okay, see, here's the thing. Then I have to jump a second time. Which I believe means in I, you. I can't do it until my feet hit the ground. Do a do a jump kick, then. Like, like, like just an... Yeah, like, like just jump, jump kick and, and mash block as it's hitting. The backbaker should connect. There we go. Okay, yeah, exactly. that works. That works. Been doing that shit since MK2. I've played these games. <laughs> well, doubt me. Look, can what? you meter burn it? I'm... Probably, Absolutely but you can. You have any idea how many buttons I'd have to hit at the same time to meter burn that? <laughs> Hitting so... more than several buttons together in a fighting game. My <sighs> God. We all wish we could help Liu Kang. There is no need to stop. Mm. I could just watch him be beat up for hours. <laughs> I really could. Kenshi, I got it. Like it really feels kind of like an apology for him stealing all of Shang's stick and nine. Just getting wailed on constantly in this game. I can't get enough. I mean. I, I can appreciate it, but at the same time, I actually like Quan Chi, so I think they I went do, a like, little far I, I, I in a do, couple of places. <laughs> I do too, but like he never, ever, ever like got comeuppance, really, from anyone. Like, he got blown up by Raiden's explosion, and like, that was about it. By the way, know? the safe word is Wu Lei. <laughs> <laughs> that question has an answer. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. You two stand guard. Prisoner transfer will be here in 20. Oh, now she trusts me to babysit. Cage, report. We haven't caught up to Devora. We had her tracked to the Makiba Cliffs, but... Her Deception reference. Damn. I appreciate it. Wait, I missed it. What? The Makiba Cliffs. Oh. Isn't the feeling of continuity nice? Sergeant, your team doesn't have two hours. We need her found immediately. Sonya. Cassie, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but there isn't... We talked about the Sonya. Be a mom sometimes. Regroup and redeploy. Yes, ma'am. They're doing their best. I know. He is such a good dad. We have a visitor. It's a good thing their cell phones are, uh... <laughs> yeah. How... <laughs> Inter-realm they... receiving. Sa cell phones use satellites to connect to each other. How does that work across realms? <laughs> it's hooked up to the OIA portal somehow. Fine. die. <laughs> Raiden needs him. Without Quan Chi, we can... That's bullshit, by the way. Uh, one of... Okay, so... Like We've talked about how, in general, we think this is the best NRS game writing-wise. Mm -hmm. But the one thing I hate about this game is this whole setup here where Scorpion is about to get to kill Quan Chi. And they make him out to be a bad guy for doing so because they come up with this ridiculous lie and half the internet actually fucking believed it that they can't restore the revenants without Quan Chi. There's an arcade my... ending in this game where a revenant is restored without Quan Chi. <laughs> my fucking thing is, 
My fucking thing with that is, is like, you can't make Quan Chi do shit. Yeah, like, he's gonna, he's gonna trick you and get away if you try to make him restore the revenants. It's yeah, not he, even gonna he, work. Yeah. If, if you make him restore the revenants and he, like, agrees to do it and do the magic res restoration spell, you don't know what that's actually fuck what that actually is. He's gonna turn himself into a clown and shoot you in the face. That, that no, could wait, be the, the fucking... Guy. That could be the fucking, like, turn everyone around me inside out spell. For yeah. all you fucking know. Yeah, you, you're gonna make him say the right magic words when you don't know which magic words you need him to say. I promise you, this does not mean turn all of your skins inside out. <laughs> so, so I did say earlier that the ninjutsu variation feels like it's supposed to represent the idea that, like, human Hanzo lost his specter powers. But, uh, I do have the teleport punch. And his x-ray also uses baby. the teleporting. This By is why I say I have always believed that the teleporting is a ninja thing, not just a hellfire thing. But there's thing. fire on it. <laughs> you also, mean people can make fire when they're not dead? Wow! Wow! <sighs> Fucking ninja powers, man. Okay, but... Let go. Let go. There wasn't I, fire I on that, it in half the games. I thought that was monk powers, not ninja powers. This... It's 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 power of writing contrivance power. Okay, regar weird. regardless of Does your... that make it fine? Does that make it good? <laughs> I agree with Smoke Man. But <sighs> regardless yeah, it didn't actually have a fire in the prior game, so that thing is silly. It got it all had to come from hell. And he's from hell and he always had to have it power from hell. Let's move on. You just said that contrivance was a good thing. <laughs> I just don't give a shit anymore, man. Regardless I will point out that he has uh, Ooh, that was cool. animations between rounds where he, he like, crawls out of a portal to hell. And those are universal. I mean, those aren't variation specific. The, the stuff like Cyrax and Sector having unique things in 9 between let, robots and ninjas Johnny get a, like, every is other the exception or and not the norm. I wish everything, all the animations, could be like accurate to what we think is going on or what is going on or what the story tells us is going on and lies to us about but that's expecting too much it really is okay there are only three prompts there yeah you should have kicked his ass more cover with scorpions exactly Ow. I really wanted to hit him with the barrel. I'm very disappointed the game took that from me. <laughs> See, there it is! There it is, right there! That is hell shit, my friend! <laughs> okay, well, if you want to talk about continuity, why does he sound exactly like Ed Boon? Yeah, right I was there, gonna huh? say that too. He doesn't <laughs> sound like that in the cutscenes. That's does... a continuity error, Razor. I play the game good. No, that's like some weird hell power echo that his voice gets uh, I, I, when he's yeah. fucking that's, supernatural that's shit. Uh, okay, it's it's canon. I understand. Also, that. I I don't like that Ed was continuing to be the get over here voice even after Scorpion got a real voice actor. I agree like, with that. We've heard was... we've heard Patrick Seitz get to do it in the Legends movies, and he sounds great doing it. So just let him do it in the game. Eh, I mean, I'm with you, but you know, author's privilege. I think also, Ed, I think I think if Ed looks back fondly in like twenty years at the at, the, at his favorite thing about this entire series and doing it, it's that he got to say the line. So here's the thing. Okay. Ed, Ed only says the line like a couple of times. Like he did it fresh for MK1. He did it for MK2, and they reused it in MK3. He did it fresh for MK4, and the MK4 clip, they reused for every game until 12. You mean like Morgan Sprite in, you know, Darkstalkers 3? Yeah, but here's my point. Morgan. So, the whole reason they keep using Ed is because Ed holds the Guinness World Record for longest guy playing the same voice in a game. But I don't think the record should count if you're reusing assets. I mean... 
the Guinness Book of World Records is kind of bullshit. No one actually tracks that shit. Talking over the best scene of the whole fucking you, game. That's fair. Dedicate them to Earth Realm's protection. Our common purpose gives us a chance to end old rivalry. We really should like hunker down and talk about how this was the most development these two ever had together, ever, and it was so long overdue. It's true. There's never a moment, even in the old timeline, where they just, like, during a calm and peaceful period, have a conversation with each other. This is my favorite moment out of all the NRS games. Every single one of them. The, I agree. Yeah. Like, there, there may have been, like, a... A making peace battlefield understanding that occurs between them during MK3, where Scorpion is like fulfilling his vow to protect Kui Liang. But we don't know that because that game didn't have cutscenes. So this is the. This is the. Um, yeah, prior to this, it's like the end of MK4 in a, in a non canon ending, you know. And they don't really interact with each other in Deadly Alliance or Deception or Armageddon. Outside of like attacking each other in the crater, pyramid, pyramid of Argus. This shit was so overdue, and it was so beautiful. Oh God, it's Benimaru. Yeah, the hair's a little overdone, I would say. <laughs> it's so tall. Boy, she didn't last long. <laughs> yeah, that's uh... stronger. You know what? We we trained Frost wrong on purpose as a joke. As a joke. <laughs> also, the the, the snow is making the the snow is making the game run poorly again. Nice. Yes. Have have we fought on Raiden's Temple yet? We we have. We, we have. fought uh, in Kung Jin's chapter. We fought during the okay. rain, and it was fine. The, the snow is more resource intensive than the rain. It would appear. Also, you know, I, ha I have noticed that on on your main menu, it's pretty it's pretty slow. Ah, that's fine. Nobody cares about a main menu. You're a main menu. Nobody cares about you. I uh. Way to get him. Way to get him. You wrecked him. Yeah, yeah. I I'm I'm ruined, sir. I have a you... question. Why the? My feelings what? are hurt. <laughs> What Maybe an options menu, so that when you select me, it's like an option select. I'm, I'm gonna get into this before you do, Razor. Uh, why okay. the fuck does Frost care about the Shirai Ryu? Yeah, that's Because a... she's angry, because they are yellow and she is blue. Frost didn't join the Lin Kuei until after Kuei Liang rebuilt it. The only thing she knows about Lin Kuei history would be what he taught her. And he doesn't hate the Shirai Ryu. So where did she learn it from? I and think this... Frost is just a really bad person that will use any excuse given to her. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Frost, Frost says that making peace with the Shirai Ryu is her core reason for turning against Sub-Zero in this game, in Eleven, and in the Onslaught mobile game. This is a consistent Dom Chiancholo problem. <laughs> what is this? I did not bring you here for treachery. Frost is strong. To be fair, this game was written by Brian Char. But yeah, but Dom was on I, the I, team. I, get I will deal with her. Maybe she just really doesn't like Scorpion. Well, she's never met him before. Today. He wants to stab people because she's a dick. Can I make a joke about giving someone head here? You may. Eh, I'll pass. Okay. <laughs> Letter, not the spirit. You are owed nothing. 
That's a surprisingly sound judgment from Mr. We Pledge Our Allegiance to Shao Kahn in the last game. <laughs> you know, I don't think any of these people are trustworthy. <laughs> Guan Chi is responsible for Bihan's death. Look at this magnificent Sato bastard. Is wrong. There is a debt to be paid. You know, personally, I kind of feel like Bihan is responsible for Bihan's death, but... Yeah. I mean... Yeah. <laughs> All of us who have played mythologies kind of know that. <laughs> Although, you know, Kwai is the one saying that. Yeah, I get it. I get it. A little bit biased. Scorpion. If I keep murdering people, like, what the hell would I die? Yes. I'll think about it. <laughs> Immediately joins the Mortal Kombat tournament. I also want to point out something that frustrates me a little bit. Like, I really like the delivery on the line, my name is Hanzo Hazashi, like, screaming it at him. But, the suggestion that Quan Chi gave him that name as part of his becoming a revenant is dumb. He was Scorpion before he died. Scorpion is a ninja code name. Right. You know, I mean, like you Sub-Zero is. Hanzo? The, when, you, when you work in crime, you want to hide your identity. That's why they wear masks, too. <laughs> I really like the opening uh, of Scorpion's Revenge, where he's talking to his kid, and they're actually, like, watching a bunch of like scorpions and ants and shit, and he's yeah, talking yeah. about all the virtues a scorpion has, and that's yeah. why. Yeah, it's it's a great scene. I love that. I mean, the thing is that he was he was given the name Scorpion by the Shirai Ryu because he uses the kunai on a rope, because it's like a stinger. Yeah. He fights like a scorpion. <laughs> not not to mention that the clan itself is all about, like, th like the name is... Yeah, the, like, the name Shirai Ryu is the name of a real-world fighting style that's based on throwing projectiles, darts, and shurikens, and kunai. Right. What if there are other Shirayu who are like named after animals, like I don't know, Moto dragons, spitting spiders, koala bears, drop bears, and so on and so forth in that fashion? Hmm, that looks like a like a really bad wound. It's either being a, like a mantis member of the Shira Ryu. So you did the voice in a cutscene too. <laughs> <laughs> that does stick out like a sore thumb, yes. It feels a little silly, doesn't it? <laughs> like I feel now, like I I really respect this scene right here. Yeah, because I really, even I really... after everything that's been done to him, he still gets away with it. Yeah, like, like this is good storytelling, that Scorpion gets his revenge, but Quan Chi still gets to pull a last-minute fast the one on smile, everybody. The smile! The little smile. Yeah, he still wins, even as he's dying. Yeah, I just, I just One hate... second too late. I just hate all of Twitter after this game coming out, think, like, oh, Scorpion shouldn't have killed him, they needed him to save the rep. No, they fucking didn't. No, they didn't, and he wouldn't have done it. Stop paying attention to MK12. Kung Lao, in the arcade endings, Kung Lao unrevenants yeah. himself yeah. just by meditating. <laughs> <laughs> they unrevenant Sindel in the next game, and they don't need Quan Chi to do it. <laughs> People come back from the dead every single game in this series. <laughs> Twitter can't hurt you anymore, dude. Not if you don't let it. I just want... I just want anybody How small listening to they this are, shit. Razor. How small they are. No, you, you, I just want anyone who's listening to us right now who fell for that shit to feel bad about themselves. That's what I want. <laughs> if That's you my like goal our, in this moment. I agree. If you enjoy our open contempt towards some of the members of our listening and viewing audience, we have Patreon. Yes, yes. Please donate money to us at patreon.com slash nethercast <laughs> if you're enjoying this content. And you feel stupid as you should. For... 
Remind me again where you get your income from, Razor. All of your income. I just... Isn't it here? Right Wanchi here? deserved to die. Scorpio deserved to kill him. We've been waiting for this moment for, at the time, 25 fucking years. <laughs> they will be neutralized. Uh, let's like call it 20, 20 years. Quanchi wasn't in MK1. <laughs> I don't like this costume. Yeah, I d we talked uh, about this before. Shinnok looks so the, the stupid with bare terrible. arms. How did he change his clothes from inside the amulet anyway? Like, is there, there a wardrobe in there? Is it, is it Genie's lamp from Aladdin? There's actually like an apartment in there. <laughs> if you hold the amulet up to your ears, ever so faintly and softly, you can hear your clothes beam. <laughs> at the sky temple. I can't believe Scorpion is fucking dead. I can. Have you not been paying so, attention for the last several <clears throat> games? So, I mean, all of them. <laughs> <laughs> so an interesting bit. Of, uh, an interesting bit here is that uh, Brian Chard has said that Bo Rai Cho in this scene was almost Kai. Yeah, yeah. There was there was like a 50-50 chance between it being either one of those two characters. And they just they went with Bo probably because Ed likes Bo better. Yeah. Ed love Ed loves Bo Ride Show. Yes, yes. Because he farts, you see. I mean, <laughs> there was probably also consideration to putting Bo in the roster, of, you know, before the game came out, and they were deciding on future waves of DLC. There was never any chance of that happening with Kai. You know this, and I know this. I. <laughs> So you my know, feelings right. on Kai are obviously that I think Mortal Kombat needs an Eddie Gordo, and I think that's exactly who Kai was always meant to be, and they just couldn't pull it off back in the MK4 days. But I also don't actually believe they could pull it off now either. <laughs> you know what, though? I have no faith in their blue in their um, motion capturing to actually be any good at doing capoeira. The scene is good with Bo. It would have been good with Kai. Yeah, no, I actually, I like what this game did with Bo. I think it made him a much better character. I really love his moveset as a DLC character. Like, the they gave him the, the cane-assisted dragon kick, which mm -hmm. I've always wanted him to have one, because he's the guy who taught Liu Kang how to do it, so he should do it, too. I love the breathing fire after taking a drink. All of that shit is cool. His his normals Honestly, like he really they, one of the highlights of the DLC. They did a good job realizing um, the the moves of a drunken master fighting style. In if, his normals. if you combine if you combine dragon's breath variation and drunken master variation, that'd be the perfect bow right show move set. Yeah. I've long regretted losing our comrades. Now you're just making me think of what they could do for Kai. <laughs> Never will. Ah, see, that's what I'm saying. You don't believe. You don't have any faith that they could pull it off either. <laughs> I. It's not even. It's see, uh, whether they can pull it off or not. Kai. Doesn't figure into it. It's just. I just. I know I'm never going to see Kai again. We have to actually get to the possibility well, now, of Kai showing up in a game before we can think of that. You see, Kai should be able to put beats in your head. Okay, but we should have never seen Mavado like again, and yet he's in twelve. I will see to it. No extraordinary means. I'm just saying, Kai could be a cameo or some shit one day. You know, you have more faith than I do. You know what's funny about this scene is they're having an argument about how they shouldn't kill even if it's Tarkatans. This flashback takes place during the middle of MK9, and Liu Kang spent all of MK9 like being a scowling asshole who wanted to kill people. I like this Kung Lao costume. Yeah, this is a good Lao costume. He looks good. Lu looks... That hair is weird. It, it, it needs it, a bit of lift. It took them until 11 to really do a good job with Lu's hair. Ew. The cheek teeth. Why the cheek teeth? Oh god, his teeth like move. For yours as well. If you harm them, you answer to me. It's a midway character and two NRS guys. 
it it is really weird to see Raiden wearing the MK1 outfit and everybody else is wearing these super uh, detailed new costumes. Now, see, for me, it's like it's the only thing I'm focused on and really, really grinny ear to ear about this entire scene. All the guys, I'm like, yeah, you're cool. Oh, that MK1 walk. Raiden, baby. I just. I would have at least done MK2 as the retro skin. Yeah, I kind of prefer the blue apron to the old white. I, I'm just happy to see the old school outfits at all, man. Oh, and this is where they gave the Tarkatans an actual language. Yeah, kind of like that. Look, that is cool. awesome shit. In his own tongue, it's not Baraka, it's Baraka. <laughs> it's kind of neat, actually. That's a nice sublime touch. It's some good world building. I'll give them that. But uh, we've done three chapters, so Raiden's actually going to be where we start next time. Oh, I hate you! I want to see him <laughs> one Raiden fight! Well, you will in a week! It's something to look forward to. Can't wait that long for Johnny to buy a car. <laughs> does he even say the gibberish in this game? Yes, this was the last game where he yeah, said the gibberish. Last game. Okay. He, doesn't, he doesn't have it in 11 or 12, but he, he had it still here. So yeah, mm. uh, something to look forward to. And if you're watching this on YouTube right now, you don't have to wait. Because that next episode will be waiting for you at patreon.com slash nethercast. Oh, that, hey. was a good, that was a good plug. <laughs> you like Great that? You see what I did Excellent. there? Excellent. Seamless. <laughs> but that's all for this week. See you later, nerds. Wait, wait, wait. Before you do it. Okay. Before you cut off. Okay. Can you just unpause and do one teleport? All right. Just one. <laughs> yeah! Okay, we're done now. Ah, you've ruined it. Well, let me let me see if he has the um. Does he even have the tackle in this variation? He has it in all the his electric, moves. It should yeah, be like back forward. Yeah. See. Excellent. Okay. I'm happy now. I'm so happy. Go, 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 go. <laughs> it's like going home again. <laughs> you know. You know. I know that Shinnok steals that move from Raiden. When you do the the move steal like yeah, special, yeah. he doesn't do any gibberish when when he does. Oh the Superman. man, they should have gotten old Troy Baker, old man voice, <laughs> no. his own version think, of the gibberish. They should have just like imported some nonsense from MK4. Oh man, that would have been amazing. <laughs> I'm gonna throw you there. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my leg! <laughs> <laughs> Shit's amazing. All right. See you later. Have guys. a nice. Oh. <laughs> Go ahead. Have Jesus. a nice day. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs>